gamle nam phu na dinga palla ho jo se central government to la Outside the road is conducted by organized by the KNT Kuki National Prayer. The reason is because on 3rd May 2023 to till last night, 18 June 2023, the Thai community attacking us, burning our houses, uh, burning the churches, and uh, brutally attacking the innocent people uh, who are still in the MOOC. Uh, till then, the state government did not pay attention to our people, did not ha did not give any help and defense and support for, uh, from the state government. We do not get any of them. So the only hope we have is now praying to the living Father and uh, hoping to help us and we keep rest. Uh, hoping to rescue us from the brutal attack of this military community. So we gather here to. Uh, submit our prayer and asking our God to help us from this brutally attack from the major people. Oh, 
Today we are all here gathered, raising our voice not against anyone, but it is only our prayer to God that God only can heal and bring peace to the community and to the uh, uh, state of Manipur through the intervention of the center of government of India. In solidarity with those people who have lost their lives, we are here condoling them and we are here praying for, praying to God so that their soul can rest in peace. The only hope that we have now is uh, the intervention of the central government of India and if possible any any means of like uh, it can be like imposing uh, article 356 presidential rule can also help out the people who had been suffering for a long time with lots of agony who had been running here and there for shelter so we had been gathering here in the masses praying to god so that the center could intervene in the uh, in the um, cause of the cookie to of people Mayong kasi na loho at wahi nung hiyam na wet sa anahi A personal prayer Ito ang hiyam na teho ina na teho hi Na na teho hi iwet sa anahi Hiti hi Tunia Anamulim sa ho Tunia anong kilado at hilo ho Anaw vok pumangkitan Akot ang kaya ang kisata na Mumazong um Alaw ala kipaymang Alaw na tuwalong inong hiyam na Ipo na na teho Ingay nun na iwet sa na teho hi Tanta na ya umahiven amo ating ahi. Hiti itaw na uhi. Gwa na dahil kayong lato na ilong hem na tiho ipo na uhi. Nga hinga kiman na hiyan lang. Ako na kiyang kitan po ahi zong lang. ตัวนี้นั่งกระทำว่าเว้ยตัวนี้ที่นั่งยืนโดนนี้ที่เราครอสตรงตรงที่ยังอาคมเดินให้จะครอสตรงนี้นะคนอาคมฮาเลียฮ
the 19th June 2023, the Kofijo community who have been praying unseeingly from Meita have gathered and formed a human chain from Gamlipai Til Tapu to pray and affirm in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ that this stretch of land has been given to us for many years and God will fight this war for us. For this and in view, I, Reverend Onmang Hauke, advisor Kukinam Pitauna, declare this prayer meet open with full hope and assurance that God will answer our prayers for the peace of our land. To God be the glory. Today, the 19th June 2023, is a day of mourning for our Zo Kuki Zo community. It is the culmination of a five-day fasting prayer organized by KNT, that is Kuki Nampi Tao Home, that has been organized in different churches throughout our district. And many churches have been praying. And why am I saying that today is a day of mourning? Because our state government, the Honorable Chief Minister of Manipur, has declared war on the Kuki Zo community, terming us as poppy planters and uh, narco terrorists. And because of that, the state government, the machinery of all the state government, has been fighting against our community, and we are being termed as militants again. While we are defending, while our husbands, our sons, and our brothers are defending our people, they are being termed as militants. And today is a day of condolence because we have lost so many lives. We have lost our dear husbands. We have lost our brothers. We have lost our dear sons. And we condole those family members. And not only our community, we condole the family members of the Meite community because we know that many of them have lost their sons, their brothers, and their husbands. And after 25 days, the Home Minister came to visit with us. And today is uh, the 45th more, more than 45 days have gone and we are very saddened by the fact that not a word has been uttered until now by our honorable prime minister of india we are very saddened there is no one to help us on this earth and there is no one to cover us there is no one to support us in this time and this is gamgi pai and our brothers and our sons and our husbands are on duty day and night in the rain and shine, under the uh, heat of the sun and everything, they are there, day in and day out, trying to protect us. Today is a day of praying for us, prayer for us. So this stretch of land, we have been threatened by the leader of Meite Lipun that they are going to wipe this stretch of land clean of all cookie communities. And we are praying to God because we have God and only God is there to protect us. Only God can save us from this threat, from these attacks. And we believe that God will answer our prayers because every land belongs to God. And God has given us this land to settle here from uh, many, many years ago, even our grandfathers and forefathers. And we believe that we will continue to inhabit this stretch of land until the day of the Lord.